Tonight, we are remembering a man who was an institution in the Acres Homes community, Joe Thomas. He passed away at the beginning of the new year. Thomas opened Joe's Barbershop a half century ago, but to the hundreds of lives he's touched over the years, it was much more than a barbershop. Our Xavier Walton looks at the legacy he leaves behind. <laughs> What you get at Joe's Barbershop is bigger and better than any haircut money could buy. Look here. Look here. At Joe's, you get a family. My dad is Joe. My grandfather was Joe. Uh, yeah, and my grandmother is Joe. And she's Norma Joe. Every single one of us was reared in this barbershop right here. Ever since I was walking, ever since I was, since I was little, Two and three years old, I've been in this barber shop. That's Jamel. Joe was... My papa. <laughs> yeah. What are you gonna miss most? <laughs> him. Yeah, yeah, my papa. <laughs> yeah. That's him. Conversations, it's talking, it's teaching. Joe raised Jamel and taught him how to be a man and how to cut hair. My grandfather used to put kids on the board. That's the thing they used to sit on when they get in the chair because they were too small to sit in the actual barber chair. Over the last 50 years, generations have sat on that same board, including. Yeah, I sat on the board. The boy has a little kid across the arms of the chair. <laughs> Houston Mayor Sylvester Turner. Joe gave the mayor his very first haircut and continued to do so for many years. For Joe's 90th birthday, a surprise. Yeah, so I have to declare this day as, as Joe Thomas Day. Joe Thomas! Yeah! He's just one of those fixtures in Acres Home. Uh, that who will be the more I truly missed, very much remembered, and, and touched, literally, he touched a lot of people's lives as well as their heads. Joe's no longer here, but his barber shop. This Joe's. You know, we will keep these doors open as long as we can. His legacy. He was an example, he was a legend. You know, he was a Christian man. Will live on for generations to come. It's not going nowhere. Joe's Barbershop would be here. Joe Thomas was 94 years old. His family is going to continue celebrating his life and his legacy this upcoming weekend. In Acres Homes, Xavier Walton, KHOU 11 News. Ah, what a wonderful story there, Xavier. Thank you. I like what the grandfather, the grandson said. Yeah. Talking and teaching. I love it. His legacy will definitely live on with that loving family. Fantastic.